so there's been some talk online about uh, the price of these. So this is only a prototype run. There's a pretty limited amount, which is why every dealer only got 10 of them. So they're kind of a hot item that's going to be tricky to get, and that's why there's kind of a premium price. But we're working on the main run, which is coming shortly after. So this is kind of a collector's item. Welcome, welcome back. It is the hottest day in the history of Massachusetts. It's about 180 degrees, real feel. And we are out in, at the beautiful Meadowbrook Orchards, which is just improving and improving. Every time I come here, there's something new and something better. And I have a special guest today. The course dog. The course dog and Anthony Bo Bodanza. Bodanza aka Bodanza Disc Golf on YouTube. One of the biggest disc golf YouTubers, I'd say. Kinda, yeah, ish. And he did, he just told me he did like daily vlogs, disc golf vlogs, like a hundred something days a year. A, a, days a row? Days. Yeah. I post like 28 videos a month, on average. So if you love disc golf, what kind of content do you make? I do a lot of reviews, a lot of, I don't, I'm not a coach at all but I am training to, my goal was to cash at a Pro Tour event and I cashed at KC Wide Open and now it's kind of the cash wow. at an Elite event and try to like push towards Elite like play, like closer to Pro Tour. I've been playing for just over a year and a half, so just trying to. Oh, you're new to the game too. Yeah, I started last January. And you're pretty good. 981 is my rating, so. 981. All right, well, we'll we're gonna find out today. <laughs> and before we start, let me show you another something cool. That's a pretty cool bag, but, oh! Have you seen Sheesh. the new bag that is coming to stores? Hashtag grip equipment on September 21st. This beauty of a bag will be available and it's blue counterpart part. So there's actually two bags, a green and a blue. And I love them both equally. If I beat you through 18 holes, do I get one today? You know what? I think we can do that. I think there's, you got some pretty good money on that. Yeah, so I'll be filming the front nine, and then on the back nine, real special video because we're gonna do a time-lapse battle. Maybe time-lapse and glitch only, because we have glitch, you bag glitch, right? Oh yeah. Because I got a couple as well, so we can probably do time-lapse and glitch. Time-lapse and glitch only on the back nine on Bodanza Disc Golf's channel. So make sure, check the link in the description uh, and watch the back nine. So here we go, hole one. Let's just throw some shots and have fun. We're keeping score. Yeah, first shot counts. What are you doing? I'm here to play and have fun. Do you wanna be on the vlog and throw? Of course. All right, let's see it. Whole one's a pretty short par four. You just wanna get over these trees. The basket is like there-ish. It's a par four that is about 500 feet, I would guess. What does the yeah. key sign say? That's Can't tell. Must bird though. And here we go. First vlog. I heard there's shot. a bad, uh, I heard it's not, your first shot on the vlog is never good, so hopefully. Yeah, so here, that. first shot on the vlog, 980 rated, caching in Pro Tours. Maybe don't use the plural of that. <laughs> That's a smash. <laughs> Thank you. That's probably the best first shot on the vlog we've ever had. Yeah. Let's go. Well, you got lucky. I threw it at World a handful of times, um, and three out of the four holes I threw it. No, that's a lie. I threw it on five holes and three of them I got birdies. I'm pretty happy with that. Here you go, I'm gonna give it some slight turn. Wow. That's crush. Cool. What's your disc of choice? It's just the zone. Okay, right the classic. Pretty easy. Tapping birdies, I have an eagle putt though. Get in. Oh. A little more one. Of course. Two off one, right? Yeah. yeah. Wouldn't expect anything else. This is probably my favorite one. 
This is the green, blue, pink rim with swirls. Yikes! I've always wanted to ace this hole too. Stay up, stay up. Oh, that might be right on the line to the OV. I don't think I can ace this hole. Yeah. I think he can. It's a tailwind. 405 feet. That's really wide in the clouds. There it comes. Wow, that's a good shot. Circle one. Can you tell the fans how did you get so good in just such a short amount of time? I played a lot. I played so much. And is this then, your job? It is now. It's been my job full time since like November, December. How old are you? 25. So you're 25, you found disc golf. Were you a YouTuber before or? I had a smaller YouTube channel and then another like small internet based business. So I was living on the road. I lived in a van when I found disc golf. So I wow. played my first round in Austin, Texas at Zoker Park. Shout out Austin. I played and, there. Uh, yeah, it's because we parked our van there because you could sleep overnight. And so, and then we played. And yeah, I just played a lot and then threw a lot of like second and third shots and would think about like, what happened wrong on my first shot if I messed it up and try to correct it. So that's kind of, I don't know. And then get nerdy about your form and looking at videos of yourself. Yeah. It really helps filming yourself. And now, Ben, how did you get so freaking good? Uh, not as good, but um, yeah, a lot of practice. I think about my form a lot too. It's still not ideal, my timing's off, but I'd recommend just looking at the pros, how they do it, and just doing it step by step. But also finding your own, own lane. You don't want to, like, you're not going to do Simons because everyone's body's different. So, that's what I recommend. We'll see you do it Simons. Okay. Let's see if Ben has what it takes. That's better line. Go in the hole. Woo! Wow, that was actually close. Yeah, pretty close. Dang. Headwind uphill. This is tricky. If Ben can be better than Simon. That's probably my least favorite miss. Top left. Yeah, it's tough on the elevated bath. Budanza to take the lead. Oh, he almost choked it away, but he made it. Oh, he did choke. Cut, cut, cut. Wow, so he's two under, and we're playing for a grip bag, so this is serious. Pretty, pretty. We're shooting into the woods. This is a straight. Shot. You can see the basket down there. Wow. The last tree to miss. Crave. Craving the bird. Yeah. Oh. I think we have to give it a little run with the glitch. Yeah, I think so too. Appropriate for the vlog. That's not a bad run. That's a tap in three. I have, I think, at least a 50 footer to save a three. So it might be a two stroke lead early on. That is not clutch. Why is the second putt always so easy? Let's see this little glitch he's got here. That's your logo, kind of, right? Or not really? Yeah, it's one of the stamps that I've run. Instead of like merch, I'll just run custom discs because that's kind of YouTuber disc golf merch. Banana Club. Yeah, that was a collab with one of my buddies, Broderick, who his thing is the Frisbee Club, and then my last name sounds like banana, so we just made the Banana Club. Broderick. I know Coach Broad. Yeah. That's Casey's editor. Yeah, he calls me Banana Frisbee for all, so we had to make that happen. Wow, it is a small world. Disc golf YouTuber community. Pretty cool. I'm one of them. I want to be one of them, even though, of course, I'm a, I'm a player <laughs> over a YouTuber, probably. But who knows? Hopefully, I can pick up YouTube a bit more in the next couple months of off-season life. Hole four. I'm going to give you the luxury of filming halfway down the fairway because you cannot see at all from the tee pad where you're going. The caddy view. 
Whoa. Oh, that was tough filming. Okay. 50 footer. He's known for his tight hyzers. Ooh, cool looking disc. And he absolutely parks it. 20 short. Oh! Literally the one freedom. <laughs> that scared me. Can't lose another stroke right now. Come on, highs are hard. Highs are hard. Great up. I think that's like 40 long. I think you're out what? Circle long. Alright, this is for a big oh. lead. All oh, left side. So poor. Let's see if you know how to put the second one though. Nope. <laughs> That's the difference. As a pro, you need to always know how to adjust from your mistakes. Oh, look at that sick disc. D does it look familiar? I gave you that. Yes. Uh, wow, let's see if you can make it. Still has the diamond magic touch to it. Good birdie. I need to say par from way down there. You need to know how to make the adjustment and make the second one every time. I think this oh, whole wait. segment I'm going to cut out of my video. <laughs> Fail. Three stroke lead. Can't be comfortable with that. As you can see, pulled it a bit early. Good kick though. Circle's edge. Ooh. I feel like I have to run it even though there's be long. Yeah, that's it, boy. That's it. <laughs> Hit right. That might be the worst shot I've ever thrown in my life. The glitches. Simon's a little off the fairway, pin high. See if he cans it. Player two will get it. Player two literally always gets it for Simon. It's insane. You have to know how to adjust. <laughs> it makes no sense, player two. Simon in player two is literally. A hundred thousand rated. I did make a shirt for my vlog, <laughs> player two. Dude, for this vlog you need to. This is what focus looks like. Oh my gosh, I'm all over ah. the pressure is getting. Let's oh. see if you know how to adjust though. Oh, he does not. What does he putt with? The cash stash. I putt with something that doesn't go in the basket right now, which is a problem. Shout out Casey White, also believes in the cash stash, even though he missed cash at Worlds. Poor Casey. Alright, so we have four holes left on the front nine. And he has a three stroke lead. Come on. No. Oh, bad kick. Oh, good second kick. Save him. Park job with the heck. Let's go. Right there. Why do I have to hit every tree? See if he has what it takes for nice. That almost looked like you have some uh, ultimate background. I mean, I play ultimate like pick up in high school, so not really, but kind of, I guess. Yeah. That's a smooth looking forehand right there. Wow, this might be the most focused man I've ever seen. For the vlog! There's no way! Easy tapping par. I'll tap in for a par. And that leaves us with three holes and three strokes on the front nine. The back nine do count, even though we're doing a time lapse challenge there. So definitely check out should, video number two. So this is a kind of new hole. You can see the basket on the other side of that wall. T pad's right here. And this is a hole I've never played before kind of tricky we can go this way you can try to sneak something this way or even this way hmm what does the sign say 356 feet 10 uphill good luck all right here we have the too close cam foreign might be a good play yeah, yeah. It is. <laughs> tough hole man yeah. possibly the most valuable disc in my bag for my game Possibly the best disc in my bag. <sighs> okay, go on. That's 
That's dirty. Okay, a bit short, but I'm putting. Budanza. Trying to get out of the woods. Oh, 35 short. What a beautiful freaking green. Like, come on. Are you kidding me? Why do I do that? Player 2 always makes it, though. Oh, my God. I really wish I would. Just on Circle's Edge here. This would be a statement putt. Oh, man. That's what we call a weak side. I have no idea. Bit inside, not good. I ran up here to the corner to try and give you a better view from what's going on. And that's not the basket. The basket is there. And if he has a forehand too. Oh yeah, that's a good line. Missed all the trees. And that's a 80 footer downhill. Oh my goodness. That was a that was that was a layup. Layup. That was a meant to be like if the wind picked up to fifteen extra miles an hour and just pushed it down the hill into the basket, that, then it would work. Yeah. Not a layup. That was filthy. You think it's like slightly flippier with a little bit of nose up or just flatter with a slightly straighter disc? I have no idea. I knew he was going to say that. Flip more. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, you should. Yeah, I threw this more stable disc with the nose up, so I had the worst of both worlds. <laughs> Miss! Yes! Miss! No! <laughs> oh no, get down, get down, get down. That is just so bad. Yeah, well this is for... Inter oh my goodness! <laughs> nope. Just short. Ooh, nice little, little bit safe though. Run, little safe run. This is for the history books. Yes! Ooh. Oh my goodness! I think I only had one birdie. That's what you call making him play to your level. Yeah, wow. Shout out Ben, shout out Bodanza Disc Golf. Again, check out links in the description to, for his channel and almost daily disc golf content. Pretty crazy. And in the end screen, you'll see a link to the back nine. We're doing a time lapse slash glitch battle. Yeah. Other than that, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and enjoy the shot of the day. We need it badly. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. Peace. Drop, 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 drop. One basket. Oh, yeah!